some big breaking news coming in from the world of Indian sport. In fact, Indian tennis. Somdev Dev Varman, part of a group of Indian tennis players who's been leading a revolt against the All India Tennis Association, has come, come forth, broken his silence. He's come and said that Aita, whatever they've said in the media regarding the changes that were demanded by the, the players, had they spoken to them directly? Had there been some kind of communication, this crisis could have been averted. He's called them completely unprofessional. Let's play out that reaction from Somdev. From what I obviously will have to uh, talk to all the players, get get us in a meeting room and then and discuss. But my from my feeling, from knowing all the guys, I'm pretty sure we would reconsider our decision because, and like I said, at the end of the day, all of us wants the best for Indian tennis. All of us wants to win Davis Cup ties. All of us wants to get back in the world group and um, give everybody a chance to uh, to you know play play for India when they deserve it. Headline says Shivani has been tracking developments. She now joins us for a live update. Shivani, when you look at you know proceedings at this stage, it's going to be a second string Indian team which goes on for the next commitments in Davis Cup, barring of course Leander Pace. The situation going from bad to worse. AITA facing a lot of criticism for the way it handled its players. That's right. It's not just a second string. In fact, it's a third string team that's going to be uh, playing against South Korea when the tie starts on the 1st of February. But what Somdev has come out and told us very categorically that he says the AITA lied about what they had told the players uh, after the selection meet yesterday. If you remember, mm. yesterday the AITA had said that we have been negotiating or talking to the players and uh, we've you know kept uh, an open uh, communication with them. We've extended the deadline and okay. we have even agreed to some of their other demands which we hadn't agreed to earlier, like six players in the team when they play in India and uh, giving business class tickets to everyone. Uh, consulting them on the physiotherapist. So on all of those issues, Aita had said yesterday that they have consulted the players and this is what we have agreed to give them as well. But what Somdev has told us very categorically now that no negotiations happened between the AITA and the players okay. after that release of the on the 6th of January when the AITA had first sent out a proposal. So he said mm -hmm. that had they come to us and had they agreed to us in person, in writing, that yes, we will agree to these things as well, then we would have reconsidered our stance and perhaps they would have decided to play. 